escape next morning, I woke up when the sun hit on my face. I stretched my arm but it got hurt something hard. Slowly opened my eyes so I an expected scene. Why the he's sleeping on my bed and shirtless? Wanted to get up but can't he is wrapping his hands around my waist tightly. He woke up when I wiggle on his grip and spoke with his sleepy voice. Pulled me more closer to him and snuggled his face on my neck. There have no inches distance between us. I was trying my best to remove his hand but this bunny was not giving me that chance. What are you doing? Leave me? All of a sudden my hands got bended by his with that he hovered over me. His face was too close that we only see each other's in our orbs. I was trapped by him, even I can push him. You know love what I'm doing. Stop calling me love. You never loved me. What did you just say? Repeat that again. Yes, I said the truth. You don't love me. If you love me, you should not able to hurt me, play with my feelings. Why did you show up again? I was moving on from you, but you again come back. What the you want from me? Can't you let me live peacefully what I did? I was going to tell you about everything that day. On your birthday, I planned it to propose you, but... You left before I could tell you. I was searching you crazily. After two days, I got to know you are here working one of my company. You don't know I want to run to you. But mom said give you some space. Give you some time. You don't know how the... I spent these two months. When I can't able to hold it, now I am here with you. I don't trust you anymore. You don't tell me the truth. Till after one week we are going back to Korea. You will know what I hide. Cause she can explain. Better than me. I love you. Break my nose deep but I turn my face to ignore him. Did you just made me look at him grabbing by my chin, not harshly, did you just ignore me? Yeah. This time he hold your both cheeks and pressed it, making your lips look more pouty. You know what, I can ruin your beautiful wit in second, but I am trying my best not to do, but I swear if you again did this. What a, you can do, Mr. John, you had to taste your own medicine. I know you never treated me like always feels me special, but you hurted my feelings. Now telling me the hidden truth, which you still hiding. You are going to ignore by me until we reach Korea. At office, Jungkook was staring at you who is busy doing some files. Poked his cheek by his tongue. So you are challenging me, honey? Not bad. Let me see how long you are gonna ignore me. As Sassy's smirk formed on his lips, he got up from his seat started to approach you. You are busy in your work, suddenly you get turned with the whole damn chair. You got dumbfounded by his sudden move. I was working on my laptop. Preparing for the meeting, I was too busy in my work, out of the blue I got turned back with my whole damn chair. It's so sudden I did not even get the time to process. I back off a little when I notice it's him. What are you doing? Get up. Trying best not to look at him. It's my question, what are you doing? Why are you ignoring me? I asked you. I smiled eternally after Noticing his shaking gaze. No, I'm not ignoring you. Try to turn your chair but he hold it, not giving you the single chance to escape. He hold your chin and spoke. You know what? You need a good punishment. 
Let me see how long you're gonna resist me. He said and left my chin. Started to going out. Let's go baby, we have meeting. Also your test. In meeting room, I was giving presentation but I can feel him staring at me. But in this stare, I was finding something strange. I don't know why I am feeling strange feeling inside my body. I noticed my hands are sweating, making me gulp my saliva. I look at him already found him staring at me with satisfied white smirk. The next, he lost his tie, not then pushed his hair on back. I know I am turning on. That's it, Mr. Han, please continue. I said and went to my seat, which is Jungkook's next. The client is representing his company. I was feeling so uneasy. First his chair, now my hormones. God and this guy is still staring at me. I took a deep breath to clam myself but end up choked. Ma'am, are you okay? Yes, Mr. Han. You don't have to worry. She is totally fine, right? I just noted Mr. Han continued his presentation. I was looking down, finding him carrying my knife. I hold his hand while glaring at him but he did not give He act my hand started to going upward under my, my leg started to shake. I was trying my best not to do something which can embarrass me. So Mr. Jia, what's your opinion? Okay, I'm sending you the details later. Mr. Han know that then the meeting got over one by one left the office room expect me and him after everyone left i stood in front of him while crossing my arms over my chest what what the heck you are doing what i was doing oh nothing listening the presentation don't be innocent you know what i'm talking about you know you are talking about this pointing toward his diet while rubbing it i know you like it if you want, I can recreate it. Come here. You're such a pivot. Stay here, I'm leaving. Why are you crying? Please don't cry, it really hurts. What about mine, which you gave me during that time? Not only your pain is pain. What about mine? You know how I get hurt when you always come home drunk. Help me, me end up seeing. It's your girl making me more angry. Why are you laughing? Did my pain looks enjoyable thing for you? 
baby stop your pain never gave me happiness it's always gave me sorrow and sadness i feel so worthless when you thought i love someone else when i'm completely belongs to you feeling pain after saw you getting sad but trust me i did everything just to save your life about you and hug you on my drunk bed let me tell you I was never got drunk, except that day when I was ever. I just wanted to get closer with you and wanted to hear your feeling which you always split thinking I was drunk. Then what about the day? That day I might be drunk, I still little sober to notice the hidden camera and the microphone on our nightstand. Someone was eyeing on me. I never wanted for me you got hurt. Why did not tell me? Did you ever talk to me? Ha? Huh? Always ignored me. I am confused. Tell me, how did you know me? Who I am? What's my real identity? To be continued.